Hello, and today I'm going to be showing you uh, two applications that you need to burn Xbox 360 games onto a dual hard disk using a Mac. And the other application is to check your Xbox 360 games before you burn them. So I'll show you the burn, uh, the iBurn 360. This is the one you use to burn the games. I'll put a download in the description. Okay, so um, you insert your Julia disc, and I haven't got none at the moment because I've used them all. <laughs> so it will come up here as Julia and whatever your um, di uh, super drive's called. That's uh, the layer break, you need that for the Xbox 360 games. Don't mess around with that number, it's auto set. On recording speed, you'll get two options, two and four. Make sure it's two. Get your ISO and drag it into this box and kick burn. Okay, so that's the iBurn 360 game. Uh, iBurn 360 application. Now let's go to another one and it's ABG 360 GUI okay and obviously there's a link but I'll put that in the description make sure it's files um, click here to browse for your ISO or .dvd file whichever one okay and once you've got it just click launch okay and I can't do it because I haven't got none burnt off. I've deleted all mine. But you'll see a um, you'll see command open, and it'll be lots of writing, lots of writing, uh, loads of codes. But then there'll be writing with green. It'll be highlighted in green, or the font will be green. That's what you want. Yellow isn't too bad. If you get that, it is, don't worry too much. But if it's red. Then you've got. Uh, then you still don't really have to start to worry, but that's bad. Uh, but ABG 360 will fix it accordingly, so you can burn it. Okay, so that's all I really wanted to show you today. If you have any questions or any videos you want me to do of anything at all, Windows or Mac based, uh, just comment. Please rate and subscribe. That would really help me out. Okay, thank you. This has been Lincoln Park, the best 97.